So yeah, you said you did bicep curls yeah. on Monday, which is good uh, because today we're both going to be doing chest. Okay. Um, I'm just going to move your coat if that's okay with you. Yeah. Um, I'll take that floor here. So the nice thing about doing uh, being tired from doing arm workouts before doing chest is it makes it hard to supplement the chest workout with your arms. Okay. So, you know, when you're benching or doing push-ups, your arms are tired, so it's all your chest. Gotcha. <clears throat> what we're going to be doing are decline push-ups. These are fun. Fucking push-ups. Yep. You're not supposed to like any of these. So, how it's going We're going to use those just because I think it's nicer to have something to hold on to as you push up. Okay. Um, uh, I'm going to move this back just a little bit more. If you don't mind, I'll push everything back. You don't need to worry about it. Um, but yeah, now it's going to work. Feet are going to go up on the chair. On the chair. Yep, these are decline push-ups. Oh shit. Okay. Which means we go oh, it's rushing to my head. And we decline. Like that. Gotcha. So these are not regular push-ups. These are declines, so they are tougher. Yeah. I'll say, see if you can't do 10. You're going to want to adjust the uh, weights so that yeah. when you touch down, they're about nipple height, maybe just below the breast. Okay. It helps simulate doing an actual bench press. Because that's about where it should be. Straighten your back. There you go. Fuck you. <laughs> hey, uh, yeah. There you go. That was good. Good. <laughs> Fuck. That's good. You're halfway there. <laughs> oh, sorry. That's good. That's good. Oh, this is fucking funny to me. All right, anyway. <laughs> That's okay. Call it there. Call it there. You did five. All right, these all right. are tough. Yeah, these are yeah. not easy. This is this. You can tell how fucking out of shape I am. Oh. God damn. All right. Well, a well, line is a shape. All right. <laughs> Good Lord. It's it's I'll not. Give, I can be the other five. I can be the other five. Okay. Finish the set then, if you can. All right. All right, all right. Fuck, uh, man. Fuck. No, no, no. If you can, finish the set. That's always a good mentality to have. That's it. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. There you go. Ooh, not bad. There's a pillow on the floor, by the way. There's a. Oh. Yeah. I missed that. All right. Uh, this ain't one of mine. I don't think it does. Well. Then that's a hard pass for me. Huh. Huh. So these are difficult for a number of reasons. Obviously, and I think you felt this right away. Right. Not even your arms, it's your core. Yeah, I felt more like here. Yep, because you have to keep your body straight. If your core is weak, you naturally arch. Right. Because an arch puts all the pressure at the top. Um, so, you know, let's just assign that we need to do some core and lower back. Uh, but yeah, pretty good. Yeah. I'll also say, you can expand these a little bit and widen them a bit so that you can get a bit lower because you're not going all the way down. Mm. You started to go maybe about to here. You want to touch as best as you can. Okay. 
These are the ones that I did, that I was showing you, uh, that I did about 80 of them a day for an entire week, and then I could not do anything for two weeks. <laughs> you know, a small price to pay. Still though, good job. You made it halfway, yeah. you finished your set, commendable. Mm. Do not sell yourself short. One set of 20. Time for the next set. How many sets are we doing today? Uh, just three. Same as usual. Kind of. Um, going in sets of threes is usually pretty good, but depending on how you're feeling or what exactly you're trying to work, you can increase the sets. Um, You can do variations of the sets as well if you want to do some regular push-ups and then some decline. Oh, and don't forget, stretch. Yeah. Is that a new base? Yeah, it's a carafe. It's a nice little thing. These, this is what I was making in my shorts that I've been posting. Oh, okay. I'll set this here. Very cool. It's a nice little thing. I never made a curry before, but I wanted to. Have you ever played Oblivion? No, I've been meaning to. There's in the Imperial City a store called the Gilded Curry. Okay. So that's why I wanted to. Even though that's not gilded, that's that's black. Yeah. <laughs> uh, decline push-ups, yes. Decline push-ups. And if you'd like, you can do just one set of these and then go to regular push-ups. Uh, if you'd rather that, but... I mean, I'll leave that up to you. You know your body best. Uh, I'll try to push you, but ultimately it's your call at the end of the day. Gotcha. Well, I'm very stoned, I'm gonna finish it. Alright. Take as long of a break as you need. Fifteen. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm feeling that. You'll probably notice uh, by very nature of the workout that this is different from all the other ones I've had you doing. Because this is a body weight workout. Right. Well, let me get it. Makes sense. Um, which means it's rather exponential in what you can gain from it while you're working out. The more you work out, the more muscle mass. The more muscle mass, the more weight. The more weight, the more you work out. The right. More, the more you work out, the more muscle mass. The positive feedback back loop. All the way down. That's five. Good job. Eight. Come on. Nine. Almost there. Ten. Oh, there you go. Fuck. Ah, I feel my toes. <laughs> yeah, I so I was like, oh, maybe let's just try to try balance it, and it was not happening. Uh, you can <laughs> do it on one leg. Uh, if you kind of tripod yourself. Yeah. And that's not too too bad. Uh, you just need to get a feel for it. I think I just put too much weight on the left down. That's all. Hey, hey. Yeah, and also, just be careful about shortchanging yourself. You're still not making it all the way down. Again, it's okay starting out. You're just getting a feel for it. But the ultimate goal is to do a complete push-up. Because that's actually a very crucial area to work. Um, when you're benching, 
there's a spot where it shifts mm -hmm. from being able to use your arms and only being able to use your chest. And that shift point is a really, what's the word? It's kind of the event horizon. Um, that's not exactly the correct word, but it's a very important point that you want to be able to work so that you can shift between the two muscle groups of pure chest versus compound chest. So while it might be easier to go just to here, the reason you're not going further is because you are using your arms. It's actually quite interesting to watch knowing what I know, just because I know about that point. I've failed many sets of benching because down to my chest, and then it stops there, and I can't shift back, and I'm just la I'm either tired or I just lack the strength. Gotcha. It's quite interesting. Quite interesting to, to see him. Here you are? I need to do that. I wrote down too. Oh, okay. Yeah. I write them down as I go so that I'm not... In case something happens, I have the tallies and then I can write down. Gotcha. Failed at 14. Oh, how are you feeling? Worn already. Worn? Yeah. yeah. That'll do it to you. Keep in mind, I'm doing double yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that's, that's the thing about push-ups, is you have to go quantity. Yeah. It's not really safe to add weight, because you need to put the weight on your back. Right. And then you need to secure it somehow, and then if something goes wrong, it's... it's... So, this isn't the best for uh, high weight, low reps, like you would for benching. Um, so it doesn't shred quite the same. This is very much an exhaustive exercise. Um, but as you as you've learned with me, the exhaustive exercise can uh, they can be pretty good. Um, how are you holding up, by the way? I'm good. I can, uh, do, I can do another rep. Not what I meant. I just meant with the working out. As oh, well. fine. I feel fine. I mean, uh, I don't normally work out, but I don't know the, the baseline. I'm still trying to figure that out. Are you usually sore the day after? Uh, a little bit. Okay. Well, if it's just a little bit, that's good. Yeah. I tried increasing the weight when I did. Uh, I did instead of uh, ten reps of twenty pounds. I'll ten reps of twenty, 20 pounds for bicep yeah. curls. Uh, oh, you add them together, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. So I did uh, fifteen. I bumped it up a little bit. That's good. Uh, probably gonna make five. Like that to... Wait. So this was with tens, right? This was with tens, and that was with. Sorry, no. This was with five. 10, 10 total weight. This is with 10 on each, 20 total. Oh, okay, okay. I was I was getting confused. I was looking at this like this was the weight because I always put my weight at the end. Gotcha. Uh, okay, well that's so, good. Amount of reps times weight for how many I did in the set that set. Okay, however it works for you. Again, the reason it's been relatively low for you is to get your joints acclimated. Right. That makes sense. Nothing's even Hunter, my buddy back home. Uh, if he goes like when he's doing skull crushers, yeah, he's been doing. Uh, last I worked out with him, his elbows were pretty sore because he needed to go back and build elbows, uh, joint strength with a lower weight instead of the ninety something pounds he was doing for the skull crushers. <laughs> I'd you like to do 90 pounds for a skull crusher? And I'll pass for now. <laughs> All right, last set for me. Yeah, sorry. I have to no, you're good. Not to do a for <laughs> That's what height does to you. <laughs> That's, I mean, yeah, you're about as tall as me, but it, it's, it's, just adjust for you. It's, it's one of those things. It's not like you can set it up for me because I'll have to adjust it anyway. Right. Yeah, because it wants to get down. Exactly. Plus, I usually don't go right at the very edge, I go a little bit behind. Yeah. A little more stable that way. Alright. Uh, strike while the iron's hot. That 
that's 10. So the first set I did a 20 in one go, then I did 15 and then five. Now it looks like I'll be doing 10 and 10. That's the exhausted part. <laughs> Plus I have been working my arms a lot the past uh, three days. So biceps, triceps, and shoulders are sore. Oh, that's 19. I want to do one more. I need to finish the set. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, okay. Oh. Yeah, this one more. Oh. Oh. Yeah. See, so as long as you finish the set, ooh, no shame in it. There's never any shame in even making it halfway and failing. Yeah. Loosened up? Yeah, no, I just want to just crack it, you know? Mm-hmm. No, I understand. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Yes, good morning. Okay. Good. You're getting lower. That's good. <laughs> that was five. Halfway point. Eight. Come on, two more. <laughs> Nine. One more. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, my arms are getting towards down there. Yep. Yeah. That's <laughs> oh, all right. Cool. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> it's not meant to be easy. Right. You do it not because it's easy, but because it is difficult. Yeah. Oh. And then, oh, one more thing about push-ups. Since you could do these on your own, even if I'm not here, or you know, you're working. Uh, maybe on a Tuesday or a Thursday when you have a busy schedule, right? And I can't work out with you. Yeah. These are something that you can do relatively safely, uh, whether it's decline or regular push-ups. I got you. Um, just again, make sure you give plenty of time to let your muscles rest before you do it. So either Tuesday or Thursday, or if you happen to go home for the weekend. Um, yeah, good job. Uh, I will, oh, that was one more thing. Something else to keep in mind. Uh, if you do these on your own, placement of your hands matter. Hands close together, and that works in your chest, right? Hands moderate distance apart, that works full chest. And hands wide, that works out of chest. Makes sense. So, again, yeah, I got you. just like arms have one, two, three, four different places to work and to really focus on depending on what you're trying to do, so too do the push ups, and that's why they're really good. Gotcha. You can even do a wide and go side to side to get that one side really pushing up mm -hmm. and uh, to focus on the the outside uh, pack. Good job, my friend. Yeah. You And we shall work out again soon. Yeah, I get back on uh, Monday morning.